Jai Gurudev. This is Narayan from Bangalore. I am an Art of Living teacher from last nine years. I am with Art of Living from last uh, 16 years. So today I would like to share a Guru story or a miracle what happened. It is sometime 10 years back, the story. So as Guruji keeps telling, know that there is a higher power that will hold your hand throughout your journey of life. Yeah? And you will overcome all the problems and will be successful. Yeah? Very true. This Guru story, it's a miracle which happened 10 years back. Though there are many miracles happening in our life, in a devotee's life, every day here and there. I would like to share which I experienced. It was sometime in 2011, April, I was like, you know, I got my dates for pre-TTC and I was busy in organizing the courses. I was uh, organizing course back to back for Vinod Menanji. I had a very blissful experience while on the course and felt a lot of peace and serenity. It was like a, I was doing my seva, sadhana and was regular to the satsangs. As Guruji says, everything will be taken care of in my heart and soul it was embedded. And this gives me a lot of confidence and faith to leave aside all my worries and to just to relax. Now I would like to tell about a dream which happened to me. I was driving to Ashram for Sunday satsang and somewhere in between I was caught by a police corps and they checked for my license and it was not renewed. So I was to pay penalty and all of a sudden I got up like what happened to Janaka no? <laughs> in Ashtavakra Gita, this is real or this is dream, <laughs> something like that happened to me and I got up and I looked into my wallet and I found it is true. My two wheeler license was not renewed from last 13 months and I never noticed that. Hmm? I took a sankalpa very next day. It was a Saturday in the morning. I got up and did my sadhana, my guru puja, and straight after that, having my breakfast, I went to the RTO, the nearby RTO, with a very positive frame of mind. I went straight to the help desk there. One old gentleman was sitting there, and I gave my papers to him and I told, I want my license to be renewed and also I need a plastic card for my four-wheeler. <laughs> then the fellow looked at me here, what is this fellow talking to me? Then he told, uh, give me that renewal one. So I gave that renewal thing and uh, he told, it's not possible here. You got this license done in Mysore. Uh, how you can get it renewed in Bangalore? You have to go to Mysore. Suddenly all the thoughts started appearing. I had to go to Mysore. At least two, three days it may take for that renewal. So I told, oh, then I asked him, is there any other way? So he looked at me and asked me, how is it possible? And I told him, please go and talk to the officer. So I told him, where do I find the officer? So he told go upstairs in the first floor you will find. Then I just followed whatever he told. I went, there was an assistant sitting outside the head RTO. I went straight to head RTO. There will be two RTO, one will be a deputy RTO and one will be a head. Um, I went straight to <laughs> straight to the head RTO. So that fellow looked at me and told, what do you want? I was told, I want to meet. His name was Uma Shankar, I still remember. So he looked at me, stared at me and he allowed me without saying anything. So I, I went and I was like, uh, Mr. Uma Shankar was there on the phone. He just gives hand signal and asked me to sit. I was sitting. I got a new uh, smartphone those days and Guruji's you know, wallpaper will be there. So I just pressed that, looked at Guruji and said, Guruji, kuch karo. <laughs> then new officer kept the phone and he asked me, what is your problem in Canada? I smiled him at him and um, explained my problem. 
and he said uh, see there is only one way cancel this card and get a new one and he asked me to write a letter and i just he gave me a piece of paper you won't believe i never asked for usually officials never do all these things they won't encourage you but to my uh, fortune i was been given a paper i just started writing and uh, he asked me where are you from and when i looked at him one thing i realized there was some similarity look wise no between me and <laughs> mr umashankar that is the reason that person uh, that uh, office uh, boy or assistant allowed me inside then he umashankar ji asked, started asking me questions where are you from where you work i told i work for id company so and so and then i also told about my involvement with art of living and all and he was listening to me attentively and adding to this he offered me uh, some badam milk and i wrote all the letter and handed over to him he glanced through it thoroughly thoroughly and then he called up the deputy regional transport officer and he told about the case by this problem and i kept the phone and he just rang the bell the assistant came in and uh, mr umashankar gave some instruction to him and trust me suddenly the whole scenario changed i started walking behind uh, the assistant the assistant went and spoke to some people there and i was surrounded by people especially these agents and all they are coming to me with application and they started filling up the application on my behalf <laughs> within few minutes i was made to sit in front of the camera and the photos for the license were been taken and until this time i had not paid any money for the renewal trust me and now this renewal of plastic card and all the application forms were filled photos were been everything has been done and uh, usually on the saturdays the finance department will get closed by 12 i reached that it was open till 12:45 i don't know the reason these are all miracles what i am telling you in truth and i gave the money for that i got the receipt i been asked to sit for some time i was sitting there for one hour and then one person came and asked me to meet rto deputy rto so i went there and i smiled and politely declined he requested me to have lunch he was having lunch as still remember i told i will have it at home then he signed all the papers after lunch and you can believe this trust me i got not only the learner license i got the driver license on the same day at 3:30 i have been told that you will receive the driving license within a one week time by post can you believe it in a government office all these things are possible i couldn't believe that by just looking at gurudev's picture and surrendering totally to him my what that was the only work i did i got i received such a vip treatment i went upstairs to thank mr roma shankar he made me sit comfortably i told him from my heart thanks i never expected this way <laughs> you you have changed my whole impression of government officers and their work culture he gave a big smile i was extremely happy for that day whatever happened everything happened so smoothly and successfully and without much effort gurudev keeps saying right you do my work i will do yours all these things are coming gurudev is taking care of us in each and every each and every just surrender to him and have faith it will take us places on reaching home tears of gratitude towards my guru dropped down in my eyes i kneeled in front of his picture and thanked him for all the love and care which is always there with me 24 bar 7 yes the guru's very existence in our life hmm, grants us all the impossible all the impossible he makes it possible that's about my 
story gratitude for my guru on this guru purnima i love you gurudev jai gurudev